also items over here. Let me grab these. Take all that. Uh, make sure that I'm grabbing all the good loot. Uh, just a lot of scrap metal at the moment. Ooh, ammo. There we go. Dr. Mobius' glasses. Uh, it's worth 900 caps. Uh, ammo. I believe this is what they all looked like, by the way. Or at least Mobius in the center. Alright, so... Uh, I think that might be it here. Oh, and he is addicted to Mencats. Just a small tidbit. Explosions plus 10, Int plus 2. Wow, that's really, really good. Okay. They look like regular glasses. Um, surgical tubing. Empty syringe. Oh, this is Boris's room. Lobotomite goggles. Minus two intelligence. Scientist scrubs. Forty-four magnum rounds. Oop, I want that jet. Uh, I believe this is uh, eight. This is the one with all the sounds. Okay. Um. Anything else in here? No. Dr. Klein. Did you retrieve the technologies yet? We need them, as I have indicated. Yeah, shut up. Science 70. I'd be honored if I can hear any knowledge that they take, had uh, to share on the sciences. Why, yes. We are filled with the knowledge you speak of. If you wish to know more, simply ask the others. They can help you. You seem like the one in charge, you are? I am Dr. Klein, Chief Head Researcher of Logistical Operations and Ideaology here at Big Mountain. I am surprised you have not heard of me. I am first in my field, first chair, as it were, back in the days of chairs. Uh... Uh, why do I have this strange passive sensation? It's a side effect of the cerebral scrubbing. It won't stop you from excreting or asking questions, apparently. I have to correct that next time. Hormonal aggressive tendencies are actively suppressed, however. They are a no-no and not permitted in the think tank. The scrubbing also ensures your silence to keep Big Mountain safe. This facility is top secret, and you cannot speak of it to anyone outside of Big Mountain. Should have done it with the last batch and the anti-aggression scrub. Uh, but I like the fight. We had to take precautions after the last visitors. They caused a great deal of damage in a short time. Should have made sure they couldn't mention Big Mountain once they left. An oversight. Who were these visitors? Dr. Eight and Dr. O could tell you more. Dr. O more than eight. The battle against the visitors damaged Eight's voice module. Suffice to say, those visitors are unwelcome. They stole a great many secrets and much technology. Impertinent. They also broke one of my trains. Who was Dr. Mobius? Dr. Mobius was, 
Ah, so the horrifying creature you saw upon the screen, twisted by science. He was once one of us. A friend. He researched in directions contrary to the think tank. Brains, 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 always about the brains. So we exiled him. He says he left of his own volition, but that was to save him the embarrassment. Uh huh. Now he sends his intelligence consuming scorpions from the Forbidden Zone to plunder the secrets of Big Mountain. He is a menace. Uh. Medicine 50. Robo scorpions drain intelligence from living creatures. How? Chems. I'm not certain. Perhaps it only affects machines. If so, you may be immune. If it is chems, then we have nothing to fear. Since we are afraid, it must not be chems, and you need not fear, which means you can test it. Logical. Okay. What is this place? This is the think tank. The nerve center of Big Mountain. The greatest research center known to man, and to us. Here we test and test and test some more in the name of science, atomic power, nuclear power, and scientific power. I heard this place called the Big Empty. Yes, because the intellectually challenged see an M and a T next to each other and take Occam's razor to it. While you are here, you will refer to this place properly, and you will do the same with the other scientists here. All right, I think I have some questions about this brain extraction you all performed. Well, we didn't actually do it. We tried to clean up after, as always, but usually the auto dock runs on remote. But we programmed it, or Mobius did. Still, this new wrinkle with the Tesla coils in your skull was unexpected. I mean, we predicted we'd have a breakthrough eventually, but... Dala knows more. She supervised your spine peel and the heart circumcision, then dumped them both into the tanks in the sink above. Quite sanitary. Uh-huh. Sure took her time. She always takes longer than projected with lobotomite surgeries. Not sure why. Uh, you said before that Mobius might have my brain. Yes. In all probable likelihoods. Yes. Possibly. That his may have gone to Mobius is merely an inkling. I don't know why, but it may be something involving the surgery code. Actually, I don't know. All I know is it misplaced itself, or it floated off. They get into robots sometimes and go on a tear. Okay. Maybe you set up the autodoc medical supply routine so you think he's responsible for the post organ dump. Yes. Always leaves back doors into things. Have to keep finding them and closing them. The auto dock is now erased of his routines. It was thorough. Only Mobius would know for sure what happened with the procedure. Perhaps. Well, and your brain, of course. It would know as well. My brain would know. It can communicate the procedure when we examine it. It is conceivable to trace its surgical scalpel prints once we have the brain. Might take some time, but your brain has no pain nerve to scream at us while we dissect it. Convenient. I detest screaming in my lab. Uh, what's this auto-dock surgery code you mentioned? Mobius's legacy code was in the old auto-dock. Yes. It fried itself after your procedure, so he couldn't tell for sure. It is unfortunate. We would have benefited from knowing how the breakthrough occurred. Even if we installed another chip, the information is lost. And why would he want my brain? Why does he seek our destruction? Why did he build robot scorpions with intelligence training stingers? It is because he hasn't cleaned his biogel in a long time. Clearly, he's got some sort of psychological corrosion. He's mad. And uh, these mechanical robo-scorpions consume intelligence. Are you certain of your findings? Dr. O is certain of his findings. And no one else in the think tank is willing to test the results. Loss of brainial power. Terrifying. O has said on many occasions his inability to comprehend Mobius's robo-schematics is because of repeated robo-scorpion stings. Ooh, okay. 
So I've talked to everyone but Dala and O. I think this is Dala's room. Oh, speaking of, uh, no, this might be Dala's room. K9000 Cybergun uses 357 Magnum. And I have the Son uh, Sonic Emitter. Uh, let's actually get these equipped. Well, at least the Sonic Emitter. I will need to use that for certain things. Just a whole bunch of clothes. Uh, teddy bears. Flowers. Glasses. Take the glasses to repair my Mobius ones. I think that is it. And this one right here. Oh, just a lot more clothes. The Mendets have worn off. Okay, uh, that is it there. Grab this box. Okay, and that should be good there. Doctor. Breaking news! Talking lobotomite arrives in Think Tank. Its purpose unknown, undefinable. Its presence here impossible. I think you meant impossible. Oh really? Now the lobotomite is a master of the dictionary arts. Do you have a doctorate in verbology? No, I do. And stop the presses! Just in for my eye monitors. Is that Rob Kotek on your arm? It is! What's your agenda bringing that in here? Uh... Uh... My Pip-Boy? How dare you bring Rob Kotek in here? What are you showing off? How great Robert House and his big company are? Oh, we can make Securitrons better than any robot those geniuses of Big Mountain can make in the last a thousand years. Uh. You're lucky I don't have hands to tear that dip boy off your arm, or feet to stomp on its stupid metal guts. Ugh. Damn Robco. Uh, I don't think I'll worry you, you by telling you what House and his robots have been up to since. <laughs> worry about House? Why would I do this? Hope he died alone in a dingy room, streaming his last remaining bodily fluids into jars. And him and his dirty girl bots. Don't even get me started on those filthy biological catcher's mitts. Uh, calm down. Just wanted to ask a question. Fine. Ask. Uh, heard you and Eight were attacked by previous visitors. I don't like to talk about it. Eight, he can't talk about it. They fried his voice module. Something good. It wasn't all the visitors, though. Only one of them got out of control. He's the one that took control of Little Yangtze, our old human farm. Uh, tell me what happened. This human. I can't believe it. He broke out of the think tank in seconds. Then he went for Yangtze, got bomb collars, and started practicing on the subjects that were still there until he got the right frequency. We were sending robots to stop him, and he was slicing and cutting through their shells with some souped-up laser gun like they were cheese paper. When he hacked into the mainframe, A tried to stop him and got fried. Me? He rerouted my processors to take control of the train network here. If you see the tunnels with the trains plowed into them, you can thank our visitor for that. He wrecked the whole place. While we were trying to keep containment on the surface, turns out he used one train to punch out a tunnel and escape. Sealed now, but... Who were the others? Two other human specimens. One arrived not long after the troublemaker. And the last one, not sure when he showed up, thought the first one was going to be lobotomized in Y-17. She got out somehow. The last subject, Klein might know more. He talked to him and let him leave the think tank. Hope he knew what he was doing. Why is that? Klein knows things we don't. And I think he told some of those things to the last visitor. 
dangerous things if they ever got out. Uh, do you have another name? Yeah, I do. It wasn't always O. I just took that one by default because sometimes it's easier to accept the mistake as long as the purpose works. I don't want to get into it. It's a sore topic with me. It makes my gel ripple. Are you sure? I'm a good listener. I got the ears for it. Great! Psychology! Clearly the worst of the sciences, right after colostodiuretics. Okay, so my name is an O. Never was. It was circular, a single character, digit, but not O. But even with enhanced sensors, no one here could get it right. Always kept seeing the letter, not the number. If they kept confusing the letter with a number, your name is Dr. Zero. Or Dr. O, Dr. Zero. Yes, thank you. Zero. I am Zero. How hard is that? A narrow, thin zero. Alright, so you want me to call you Zero, or...? Zero's my name. I'm proud of it, alright? It doesn't get the recognition it deserves. Truth be told, my emotional attachment to it doesn't even register compared to just having people recognize the difference. It's just that they're both sort of round and hollow, so when they monitor scan them, they assume that, oh, it's O. Oh. Vivisect me, please. Uh, if you wanted to differentiate the zero and O, oh, just put a slash to the zero. What? Uh... It's standard term link code to distinguish the two. Did... Did I shoot myself with a brainial beam or something? That's brilliant! I mean, I would have come to the same conclusion... eventually. Oh, oh, who am I deceiving? I never would have figured that out. I can't figure anything out. I'm... Uh, I'm useless. Dude, breach? Uh, so is that what you want to be? Exactly. At least the old name was indisputable. O is more like surprise. Oh, look what I stepped in. Uh, well, there's power in zero. It reduces anything multiplied against it to zero. Well, of course it does. That's the most lethal of mathematics. That's pretty cool, actually. Destroyer of numbers. I already wreck every robot I study. Why not basic arithmetic? I like your solution. With that kind of slash in the middle, I can set myself apart. If I wanted to. The make a zero in all the think tank. They won't be able to escape it. That diagonal slash right down the middle. Thanks. Talking to you, it really helped unclog some frustration. Talking. What a primitive form of thought kicking. Uh, yeah, so Zero got any amazing discoveries this year? You know, hearing my name said like that, it really derezzes my screens. As for discoveries, well, of course. Look at this. Just, uh, built it. Amazing, isn't it? To scrap electronics. Certainly is interesting, whatever it once was. You know what? I'm not even gonna pretend. I broke one of the monitors, and those innards start falling out everywhere. If you could just hold on to that for me until, well, forever, that would be welcome. Uh... Uh, what do you do here? All things robotical. You see a robot? I made it. See a broken robot? I made it that way. Deconstructed it down to parts. I have a gift with machines. I can render anything inoperable. Preserve I mean, them in the a non-functioning state. Um, that doesn't sound impressive, breaking machines, that is. Who asked you? You just wait until a working machine threatens you, and you'll wish I was around. Um... I need more of those worthless caps to test out the CIU barter function upstairs. I'd have a few left. Let me check. Yeah, there were a few under the monitors here. Here you go. Keeps the place tidy. Huh, 50 bottle caps. Cool. Uh, tell me about Mobius and these monsters of his. That genius Mobius somehow cobbles together these really impressive looking robot scorpions with spare parts. Even painted them. Try to see what makes them tick. Can't even examine them without them detonating all over me. Left with shrapnel and burns. Every 
time. Supposedly, he has even larger models, even a giant robot scorpion, hidden deep within the Forbidden Zone. Yeah, right. Giant monsters, sure. Uh, giant robot scorpion. Yeah, crazy, right? Something right out of a midnight science fiction feature. Ridiculous. What are the odds? Alright, um, can you tell me about this facility? Big Mountain used to be a mountain. Then there was a slight mishap. Now it's a crater. The dome used to be buried, now it's exposed to the sky. Don't get me wrong. It makes the sky light up like a planetarium at night. All those spectra. So soothing. And that's it for me. I've leveled up. Woohoo. Uh, so let's get sneak to 50. Uh, ex let's get energy's weapons to 60. And that should be good for that. Anything new? Lessons learned? Nope. Nothing new. Um, so I have scrounger and uh, all that kind of stuff. Let's grab uh, scatter guns when using shotguns, regardless of am ammunition. I kind of want to get shotgun, uh, shotgun surgeon. It is actually just in general good because it just says ignore uh, damage threshold with it. So let's do that. Shock and surge. I'm at 34. I have 16 more levels until I hit the cap. Uh, Dala. You are an unusual specimen to so boldly walk into the mighty expanse of the think tank. Fearless and proud as a teddy bear. Between the extraction of their higher reasoning abilities and urination inducing fear, most lobotomites dare not approach us, let alone speak to us yet you have no such fear facing me epidermis flushed with blood plasma running molten beneath your face contorting with muscular expression will you indulge me say a few words <laughs> face towards the monitors please so that i might record it for further examination uh the quick scribe jumped over the lazy paladin? Yes, yes, go on. Seeing your lips and mouth forming words, both revolting and somehow... How does it feel to have the flesh roll around in your mouth like that? To control each muscle and the tongue? Like having a fish or extremely dexterous slug lolling and flopping in one's mouth or cavity. Uh, Shoshé La Femme. Seems to me you have more biological needs than your counterparts. What? Nonsense. Run your hands along the sides of your face and then exhale rapidly. What? What are you doing? Uh, turn and cough roughly, then slowly scratch nose. Stop it. Why? Why are you making me partake in this filthy formography? Close eyelids and breathe deeply, then stretch languidly. Enough. I'm already intrigued. You have sufficiently percolated me. I don't know what it is about the biology of lobotomites. It's... It infects my thoughts. All that skin and muscle and tissue. Uh, why not? Why don't you just give in? There's nothing wrong with looking at the human body. Perhaps, perhaps there is value in what you say. I, I did so enjoy breathing once, long ago. could come back any time and just breathe if you want. Would you? I feel so ashamed, but yet so intrigued. You'll need to give me a rest in between visits, or else my gel might run over. If you're ready, let me radar scan you. Slowly. Woo. <laughs> Bloop, 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 
Doctorates, how is that even possible? Why, we create not only scientific marvels here at Big Mountain, but new sciences as well. Everything can be quantified, categorized, and dissected until every group can be subgrouped or partitioned. Alright, first head chief researcher. What is a name without a title or suffix for the sake of hierarchy? It is a long-standing quantification of personality and importance. We could not do without it. Surely you must be aware of the gravity of such attached appellations, just as surely as you must have a title. I'm sometimes called a courier. Oh, a mailman. A delivery man. Someone who takes parcels from place to place using their primitive feet or similar conveyance. You are the second one I've met in recent times. Very different specimens. There's another courier? Of course. You must have met others in your travels. This one had met other couriers, too. Although it sounded as if he hadn't met the correct one. He asked us all many questions. And then he asked a most perplexing one. We had to segment the event out of our memories for safety. Uh, what was the question? I do not know, nor should we try to access it. Perhaps Klein has the logs. My evaluation would be to let your own curiosity go. I do not think that Klein remembers the conversation as being satisfactory. Uh, why did you remove my brain and how? Oh, removing it is a simple procedure. Well, except the complications it can cause to the heart and spine. But once the heart and spine are gone, no trouble at all. Clamp the subject down. One laser incision around the skull. Crack. Snip. Done. The brain is finally free of the skin envelope, which is then kept automated for cleanup duties around Big Mountain. Lobotomites. With you, however, something is definitely wrong. We've never had a lobotomite who kept speaking after being forcibly lobotomized. I am relieved the pacification field is working. If it didn't, I would broadcast some concern to my colleagues about safety protocols. How am I still alive and walking around? That is a good question. My theory is that the Tesla coils in your brain pan are still connected to your brain somehow. It really could be anywhere. Brains are a lot smarter than most researchers give them credit for. We still have your spine and heart. If you were to somehow find your brain, wherever it slurped off to, you could humanically reduce yourself again. Okay, I think that's it for me here. Then let's talk to Klein about the courier. I can hear your penis-tipped feet tromping around. 
I should make that Did like you retrieve the technologies yet? We need them, as I have indicated. Heard one of your previous visitors, the Tom, spoke to you and asked some questions. Hmm? Oh, yes, the last visitor. Well, the one just before you. Had an interesting name from some language that's almost impossible to speak. What did we speak about? Melancholy fellow. Had questions about uh, history, but... Our conversation got interrupted. Twice, I believe. Once when the trains got derailed, and then a second time. Oddly enough, now that I'm accessing my databanks, I don't recall what the second time was. Mobius's incessant transmissions keep distracting me. Also, we didn't brain-scrub the visitor. He may have left with some knowledge he shouldn't have. I believe, maybe... Oh, well, I'm sure it's of no consequence. I don't make many mistakes in calculation or perception, so probability favors me. Okay. He came and went uh, that way. That's a funny quest, because that's what uh, your beginning quest is, except instead of he, it's they. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I have... Man's best friend, sodden emitter upgrade. Let's do a brain's best friend. Oh, I should also head and get the uh, what you call the vendor set up. Salutations and felicitations, sir, and a most jocund welcome to the sink. I am your electronic valet and household central processor. May I be of service, sir? Uh, sir, you're aware that I'm a... <laughs> Indubitably, sir, but it is with a great lugubriousness that I must disclose that my program has installed only the masculine honorific, sir. Moreover, they neglected to enclose a parameter by which said honorific might be omitted altogether. Over my most strenuous of remonstrances, sir. Are you some kind of artificial intelligence? Regrettably not, sir. All modules in this habitat are synthetic personalities atop a mundane operating system. There is no intelligence here, sir. You mean there are other personality modules here? Indeed, sir. Though if sir's aim is to activate them, I lament to inform, sir, that most have been offline for some years. If sir were to ask my opinion, I should venture that sir is better off without them. However, if Sir is determined to inflict upon Sir's self their dubious services, Sir might locate backup personality disks elsewhere in the facility. Uh, so I can access their functions without loading the personality holotapes? Tragically, the core operating systems are also located on the personality tapes, Sir. Once the tape is installed, Sir may request I switch their dialectic interfaces off, and I shall oblige with great delectation. However... Sir will still be required to locate and install a backup holotape to access their functionality. Are there so many personality modules? As I am given to understand, sir, this facility was once the property of a Dr. Mobius. He crafted the personality modules as part of a collection of experiments on the subject of machine-human interface. As to the reason for the unusual choices of devices to receive the modules, I cannot say. Uh, let me ask something else. Uh, what services do you provide? In addition to managing the personality matrices of the other household utilities, I can provide, sir, with direct access to the commissary. Any goods, sir, might require may be purchased through my shopkeep interface, whence tiny robots shall deliver them forthwith to this very domicile. Hey, buy some things. Very good, sir. Should, sir, be in the market for a new suit of morning wear, I have several suggestions that might suit. Okay... Grab all your ammo. Uh, five auto. Hell yeah. Um, get your slugs. Twelve point sevens. Uh, twenty-five millimeters. Five five six. Grab those and those. Is there really anything else? Oh, I can get another sonic emitter. I'll 
grab the weapon repair kits. Let me sell some stuff. Uh, the scientist glove. Uh, I'd like to sell the scientist scrubs, maybe. Nah, I'll hold off. Instead, I will sell the miscellaneous crap that I've been collecting. Like that. Uh, electronics and scrap metal and wonder glue. That should be good. Oh, um. Yeah, you don't really sell much else. So, I'm going to. Oh, I. Uh, this door is not open. Uh, that's where your brain's supposed to be, the heart. Uh, yeah, I can't put these back in until the heart is back. Not heart, uh, the brain is back. So in the meantime, in the trunk, I will throw my uh, scrubs, radiation suit, and all that kind of crap. Okay, um... So, with that done, let's take a look at quests again. I'd be very much willing to look for all of these. So, let's head out. Do a save. As I can already see, potential enemy. Let's check my map for what's going on here. So, already two locations. Uh... Not two, uh, three locations for hollow discs. That one relatively close to the others. Uh, Sonic emitter. Yeah, so let's do all my friends have off switches because that will lend some exploring to be done for me. Intruder, you will not escape the eyes of my Robo Scorpions or their pincers. No shooting me. Bad. Alright. Uh, seem to be more people uh, somewhere. Hunting shotgun. Thank you. Um, oh, I see you. Wow. Uh, this is just a rifle at this point with slugs. That's awesome. Do, 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 do. I would like the music off, actually, in case this gets copyright. That's all it was. Okay. I do like how this is a sniper rifle now. Uh, what you got? Uh, you also have a hunting shotgun. Cool. Uh, I see some radix. No, it's buff out actually. Okay. Oh, more of them over. Oh, that's a lot of them over there. Jeez. Quite a few. Head be gone. Yeah, slugs make this gun so much better. Oh, also, the DT should also be making this better. The Shotgun Surgeon. I ignore more resistances and such. That's why at the bottom, whenever you see me hit them, uh, you see a broken shield. That's because their uh, resistances can't handle the armor penetration of my weapon. Okay, um, oh, 
under a cave here. Ulysses Point. Uh, Ulysses, I believe, is the name of the other courier. So let's check this out. Make sure there are no traps. Uh, da, 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 nothing really that I want. A lot of purified water. And hollow tapes. Patient Didn't block. think you'd make it back. Almost didn't. Got my answers. You're Elijah. He met the gods in this place. Did a good job of making them question the way of things. Do you know where he went? He's gone to the Sierra Madre. That's a special kind of hell. He won't come back. Someone smarter and tougher is going to kill him. If the Madre doesn't. I have to go after him. I'm not going to talk you out of it. Know what it means to track someone you share history with. Got a meeting of my own. That courier? Get her to come to me. Got a message for her. Like the message she had for me. Make them walk the road west, straight and true. Sink their feet in old world ash. Let storms tear at them. See the divide. See what happened. The divide? There's nothing there. Nothing there. Like the big empty. The Sierra Madre. No. The old world sleeps there. Sure as the flag I carry. The courier knows the way. And at the divide. Ooh, so it sounds like this courier knows me. I already know the story of it, but I won't spoil this one. Don't want to argue philosophy with you. Brotherhood are preservationists. Tech in the wrong hands, it's dangerous. Mojave's proof. No denying that. Proof's here in this crater, all around us. Your tribe, the Brotherhood, haven't met many of you. Wanted to. Thought you might be the last chance for the Mojave, the West, the East. But you're all the same mind. Obsessed. Elijah is obsessed. He's mad. It's why they ordered his execution. Two are more alike than you know. Two wrapped up in the wrong bits of history to see ahead. Not judging. I know how it is. People are like couriers. You and him sometimes don't even know the message they bring. You all had a new flag. Thought maybe new ideas along with it. What you believe isn't any better than the bear or bull. No future in either. So says the man with the old world flag on his back. America, the Commonwealth, burned away. America sleeps. And until it's dead, I carry it. Just like I carried you. More than hope. Belief. There's voices here in the big empty. I want to talk to them. Not like your Elijah did. Got questions. Don't want to argue philosophy with you. Brother- That is it with them. Wow, you guys are trying to uh, ambush me. Understood. Are you out there, my little teddy bear in the bottom night? Darling, this is you. And the bit of hazard of your peace feet so I am a monster with this thing. Pain. Wow, a lot of them keep coming over here. Uh, 
uh, still a lot of them mark. Oh, that's why. Nice and easy. Any more? So these guys are taken care of. I believe they came out because I triggered them by going into that cache. Okay. Um... Pig's Village. And also, Brother Elijah, uh, they did say that uh, Elijah, the, the human, was doing experiments on them here in the Higgs Village. So. Discover it. This is where everyone used to live before they became floating jars. their own slice of heaven right here. This is, I think, Zero's home. Securitron, yep. Yeah, it makes sense because, you know, he breaks everything he touches. I believe that that's him before he uh no that this is house actually i believe um uh, ba -ba. okay uh what's upstairs more securitrons Ooh. Audio sample, giant tarantula. Uh, this holotape contains an audio sample entitled Giant Tarantula Attack. It can be used to modify the sonic emitter weapon at the Sinks jukebox. I have to get the, uh, the holotape. So, yeah, you'll find a recalibration file for the sonic emitter. Take it to the jukebox and sync to recalibrate the sonic emitter for new effects. I have to get the hollow tape to do that first, though. Okay, I think that might be it. Or at least that uh, house. 104. Don't know whose house this one is. I can't remember it. A lot of wine, a vacuum cleaner. Yeah, don't know whose house this is. Oh, this might be Dala. I see all the teddy bears. lot of sexy sleepwear. Bottle caps. Just a whole bunch of teddy bears also. Yeah, nothing special. Oh, wait. Uh, this looks like it might go somewhere, but I guess not. Unless... Do I like to put the teddy bear back on the stool or something like that? Nah. Oh, wait. Recipes. Speech skill book. I already have my speech skill maxed out, though. This holotip contains a workbench recipe that allows you to make a speech skill book. Right. I'm already maxed out on that. Next one. 
Oh, this might be eight. Okay. A lot of sarsaparilla and all that. Sync project jukebox. This hollow tip contains the functionality profile for the sync robotic assistant jukebox. So this is what I was looking for. Okay. Uh, sunset sarsaparilla. Ooh, audio sample, opera singer. I don't see anything else. Explored down here. And nothing of import. Next one. This is Boris, I believe. All the animal cages. Okay. I didn't mean to pick the camera. Let me drop that. Uh, I think that's good for me. Anything upstairs? Scientist glove. Oh, I see the medicine skill book. I could actually make those and get some use out of it. More scientist gloves. What the hell was that? Okay, grab all those. Eh, I think that might be it. Moving on. So is there anything in here? I see caps and stem pack. No wishes for any of you with this. Let me out. All right. Uh, I believe I ended with this building. Nope, oh, there's a camera here, so someone died. Nuka Cola. This looks like it might be Dr. Mobius's. Toaster, uh, a lot of systems. Science skill book. I think I have my science skill maxed out. A lot of mentats. Yeah, uh, like I said, I'm pretty sure this is Mobius' house because he had a, a crippling mentat addiction. Anything else in here? Not more mentats. Give me all them caps. Just the cigarettes. Oh, I want the bobby pin. Uh, da, 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 da. 
Good morning, USA. I got a feeling it's going to be a wonderful day. Okay. Move on to the next one, I believe. Oh, whose place is this? Okay. Don't see anything special at the moment. Uh, uh this looks a uh, book shoot. Uh, what does the book shoot do? Uh, Robotic assistant for the book shoot. Okay. Take a look through all these. I'll just take all that. Give me that. Ooh. Dr. Klein's glove. So this is Klein's place. Anything else here? Mentats. Let's take a look at what this glove does. Uh, let's also just do this real quick. Okay. Dr. Klein's glove. Critical hit weakens strength. Uh, it's also minus two. My, why is it? What? Oh, or, or does that do that to my enemy? I think it's like do that to my enemy. Okay. Um, might be. I think that might be it in here. I didn't see anything else. Oh, wait. There's a whole bunch of alcohol back here. I'm just fine. Oh, wait. Uh, Sunset Sarsaparilla. Okay. Now I'm good. And I think I started off in here in yeah, zero, 00. Uh, take a look around outside these places now. Grab all that right there. Ooh, double bag. Okay. I'm also going to have to look for Little Yang Z. Uh, da -da. That's a Nuka Cola victory in the bushes. Anything else? I don't see much else. Oh, no, 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 no. Bad, 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 bad. I thought he was supposed to be good. Like, uh, there was the chance of uh, having him be nice. Um, you gonna just stay over there? Bad doggy. Bad doggy. Really bad dog. Uh, that was just over its shoulder. There we go, finally. Tough as hell, little thing. Is it going to be stuck like this? Okay. Egg timer. 
chicken leg. Oh, that was Gabe. Uh, I meant... Well, no, that was Stripe. What the hell? Trace of Gabe. Yeah. Take Gabe's bowl. Chicken leg. Okay. All these mentats. Alright, I think it's uh, time to head out. Oh, wait, maybe, maybe not. There's stuff over here, too. Okay. Now it's time to head out. Do, 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 be, do, bow, wow. I'm pretty sure I, oh, I didn't check these. Really? Grab all that. Don't care, don't care. 